Okay, so if you've been following along the solar batch heater, uh, I've been doing a few updates to show how well this thing's working. And this is going to be the July 2nd update, so let's get started. Just going to open up the hot water. Haven't used any hot water so far today. Okay, so I'm just going to fill up five gallon buckets and then dump them in the pool. So the first bucket is about 126. Okay, and the last bucket, the tenth bucket is 83. Okay, so the temperature of the water in the tank is 126 at the first five gallons, 121 for the second five gallons, all the way on down to 83 for the last five gallons. So one thing that's a little deceiving about this is uh, the way we're draining it is we're pushing 72 degree water into the tank and mixing it with the hot water as we're draining it. So actually the water in the tank is quite a bit hotter than what this shows, but for our purposes this is what you would get if you actually were to just open it up and use it for showers and whatever. So I think it's a pretty good representation of what to expect. So this shows a comparison of the tank from April 30th to the tank on July 2nd. We see it's gone up about 18 degrees or so. This is mainly because the tank's in the sun a lot longer now and it's a lot hotter out. It's about 90 degrees out. So overall I'm really happy with it so far. Uh, it's been supplying probably 80% of our hot water. And if we look at the graph, we see back in March we're in the mid 80s and then working our way up to about a week ago it was 131. I think it'll stay up around here for another month or so and then probably start heading back down. So that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.